Hey guys, Woody Zun here. Um, so I'm gonna break down the move Dao Hua. So broad, broadsword flower, which is the maneuver that uh, Jin Wang Sun uses in volume four, chapter 60. Uh, this is, remember we're calling this a technique and not a move because if you read the earlier chapters, the techniques are components that make up a move, which is why sometimes you read it and you'll reread something like he threw 12 punches and then that's counted as only one move. And you're confused, so that's why we're making that differentiation. Anyway, so Dao Hua is a, basically a technique. It serves neither as defense or attack. It could be because at the end of the day, you lick somebody with a blade, it's gonna hurt him, unless you're me. But, so when this is usually used as a setup for other techniques to follow. So quickly, from the front angle, it looks like so. Okay, so, not with a wrist, or if you're doing it with a closer towards your body. And the side. So that's far, now with a closer, you're on. So as you can see where it finished, I finished up here on my shoulder, which is basically a starting position for another attack, for example, a straight thrust. So uh, another thing I want to quickly say is you can move your body as you do it as well. So you can be doing this and stepping at the same time. There's no strict rules on that. So for example, you could be on one, two, coming back, or from the side, coming back. So that's just one way you can do it. Of course, there are all sorts of different ways. You don't necessarily need to come here and come fling them back out. Again, it's the setup and things move from there. Um, as you were noticing as well, you can do it with just the wrist or you can do it with your whole body. Doesn't really matter. If you like this sort of stuff and you would like me to do more of these to break down more of the moves within the series, um, let me know below in the comments. And if there's a specific one, leave that one there too. Hopefully that was the information.